So, what's up people and welcome to the Mission 98 discussion of Spy Family. So, Mission 98 came out a few days ago. And as always, I will leave a link to this mission that's currently being shown on the publisher's official website, Manga Plus, for free to the North American audience. So, if you're interested, yeah, we'll go take a look at this mission before they pull this mission back. Okay, so with Chapter 98 or Mission 98... We continue on with this backstory regarding Henry and Martha. And I really enjoy this story a lot because it's tying in two stories, right? One with regards to what happened to them with respect to the war that's coming or is actually already existing. And the other is, of course, the relationship that's building between these two characters, knowing what happened to them in the present time. And so we continue on. We already know that Henry has returned to Eden College as a teacher. And what we find out in this mission is that the war has actually already begun. And the reason Henry has come back early is because they can't afford to keep him in the extended period. They need as many teachers as possible. So they brought him back earlier than was originally scheduled. And so we're already starting to see the consequences of the war to the everyday life, even in the people who are away from the war. And of course, Henry, being the elegant person, starts complaining about the fact that the war is really affecting the elegant nature of life. And even something that is supposed to be the news has become more of propaganda than of truth. And from a person like Henry... He has a very difficult time accepting that. But for Martha, of course, she's just happy that Henry is back. And her reply is, you really haven't changed, have you, Henry? And Henry replies back, well, neither have you. And Martha counters and says, that's not true. I have become an imperial scholar. And what you find out is that, of course, she has become an imperial scholar not only for the sake of excellence, but for the sake of being able to preserve that tea time that she cherished with Henry when Henry was still a student here. And so since she kept that going, the area where they took tea still exists. And what you see is that now that Henry is back as a teacher, despite the war, Martha is happy because they have the time to be able to enjoy tea once again. It's as if they were able to go back to the times that Martha really enjoyed. But with that said, of course, you can't really ignore the war. And as the days keep on going, you see how the war is affecting everybody, including the students at Eden College. They are oftentimes required to go into a bunker during a situation when it becomes tense. And in there, you hear all about the gossips that go on with regards to the war. Somebody's relative has passed away. Some town has gotten bombed. But the most interesting one is they're now having rumors about children getting abducted and being used for experiments by the enemy country. And of course, this then kind of gives the inkling of what happened with Anya. She is a product of experimentation. But of course, they're talking about a rumor that happens in Westalia rather than Ostania. And of course, Project Apple is a Ostania project. But it is interesting. Maybe there is something related to it in that Ostania is doing some experimentation with children, but they don't want the public to know. So any information that may get leaked out will be blamed to the Western country. Whatever the case... The war is affecting the community, and Henry is really starting to wonder why he is continuing to try to be a teacher, regardless of the efforts that he has to try to teach the children elegance. With the war going, there is no indication that he is succeeding in being able to teach anything. And as it keeps on going, the war escalates, and now it starts affecting both Martha and Henry, In that the ballet company that Martha wanted to join after she graduates gets caught in the war and the people who were in that ballet troupe all get killed. And because of that, of course, the ballet theater closes and Martha is directly seeing the consequence of the war. And luckily Henry is there so that he can comfort Martha 
because that did affect Martha quite a bit. I'm not sure if it's because she had a personal tie with some of the people in the troop, but it did shut down the dream that she wanted to have with regards to moving on with her being an artist and a dancer. And now there was that question we had in Mission 97. Why did Martha stop being an artist and become a soldier? And so we see what's happening in chapter 98. When Henry comes up and complains to Martha, why did you join the military? And it's basically because of the situation that happened with the ballet company. Not only did it shut down her dream, but it showed firsthand what is happening to the country. The war is tearing the country apart. And if she doesn't help support the ability to preserve and defend the country, there is nothing that she can do to say that this won't continue to go on. She lost everything that she wanted to do in the future, and she's not about to lose anything more, and so she decided to fight back and join the military. Now, of course, what she's talking about with regards to losing more is Henry, of course. And Henry starts responding back, I never asked you to defend me, which was not the appropriate comment for Martha to hear during a time when she was in terrible despair. And she basically says, it seems like you haven't changed. You just don't get it. And now Henry probably understands that his idealism, his hard-headedness, and his stubbornness towards wanting to force elegance towards the country made him blind to the things that he should have done with the people close to him namely Martha. But he didn't realize that at that time, so he kept on focusing his efforts towards trying to bring elegance to the students. And what you see is that because Martha joined the military, their time during the tea sessions no longer continued. And of course, the war keeps on affecting everybody, including Henry. As much as being a teacher keeps him away from the war, it doesn't prevent him from ever having to go to the war. And so Henry's family starts panicking and wanting to make sure that he can move on with his life. They start pressuring him as to going forward with some arranged potential marriage relationships. Now Martha overhears that and realizes that if this continues and if the war pushes Henry's family to persuade Henry to have a relationship, then she would definitely lose everything that she held dear. And this, of course, drives Martha to make the commitment. During the final dance where Henry is there, Martha appears in uniform and asks Henry for the dance. And what's interesting is you see the two dancing and you already see inklings of the recent Henry Henderson in the way he's dressed during that dance. You could see that he is dressed very elegantly and this is something that he carries on even to this present date. But what you find out is that because he was more into scholastics at that time, he was not a very good dancer and the dance becomes extremely awkward. And it actually reflects the awkward nature of the dance that Damien and Anya had. And so maybe he gave that advice to Damien and Anya with regards to trying to dance as elegantly as possible, remembering firsthand how he danced and his requirement to say if he wanted to keep Martha happy, he should try to do everything to become elegant even in this sort of situation. And it is at this time that Henry finally apologizes to Martha, saying that his stubbornness and his complete focus towards education kept him away from realizing everybody else's feelings and how he pushed his ideals towards Martha may not have been the right thing at that time. But that wasn't the purpose of this dance. And Martha basically says, you think too much to Henry. But what she wanted to do was, of course, confess to Henry her feelings. But what we find out is that, yes, the war continues to affect the relationship of these two. 
when the siren goes off, indicating that they are being attacked. And so this chapter ends at that point in a cliffhanger. And what we know, considering that they never got together after this in the present date, something will happen that will bring these two apart. Whatever happens in the next chapter in the city will probably drive Martha to have to go back to the military and do whatever she needs to do to defend the city. And at that point, maybe she will be sent off to the war and those two will not be able to come back together again. And Martha, most likely, even to this present date, has never confessed to Henry with regards to her feelings. At least, it feels that way, considering the fact that Henry is such an elegant man. If he knew what Martha's feelings were, he probably would have done something about it so that they would be together at this present time. But what is interesting is, coming back to this dance, the fact that it was such an important event for Martha, and possibly for Henry as well, knowing that they may not be able to see each other again, and the fact that they did dance recently in the most recent gala at Eden College, makes you understand just how important that dance was. It was a pleasure to see how he was willing to ask Martha to dance. But now, knowing this story, we understand it wasn't just about elegance. It wasn't just about courtesy. It was most likely to bring back the relationship that they have. And so this backstory is actually starting to give some foreshadowing to what they may be doing together in the recent time. And of course, as much as this is a cliffhanger, we do know that these two people are still alive in the present time. So whatever happens, it won't be a completely tragic story with regards to these two. But it will be interesting to see what happens that will bring these two apart. And most likely, we will see it in chapter 99. We're getting close to the centennial chapter. And it will be interesting to see what Tatsuya Endo has for that particular milestone. But in any case, before the 100th chapter, we do have to see what happens in chapter 99. And once that comes out, I'll bring out another video. I hope you join me at that time. And until then, happy manga reading. And as always, giant nice day everyone.